That there is a big pile of poo. So we're getting ready for the spring and getting ready for the growing season and we're getting the garden ready. We've got some manure that we've brought in and that's only part of it. We're going to get some more bread in here too. We really need that here. We've got really, really, really sandy soil. So we've got the garden started and come for a walk with me and I'll talk about the rest of the stuff that's going on. So if you've watched our videos for a while, you know that we lost our bees a while ago. Um, they didn't even stick around for the winter to see if they could survive winter. So the question on our minds all winter has been, are we going to get more bees for this year? The dates for ordering bees just kind of came and went and we couldn't bring ourselves to order bees this year. What we're going to do instead is put out some bait hives um, or nukes, whatever you want to call them, to see if we can attract some bees to come in you know, during swarm season. Um, so we may keep bees this year, it just kind of depends on our luck and if some bees come in and decide to take up residence around here. So as for the chickens, um, you may remember that we lost those two. Uh, the remaining chicken that was that survived the, the dog attack is at a friend's house, but um, we're gonna get some chicks this week. I'm gonna get some black Osterlorp. Uh, that's the breed that I like out of all of them that we've had so far. So we're gonna get some of those. I've got the brooder pen all set up and ready to go, and we're excited to get some more chickens. Um, I just feel like I have more confidence keeping chickens than I have keeping bees at this point. And chickens are, in my mind, a lot lower risk, um, money-wise anyway. Uh, it's a lot uh, lower investment, if you want to put it that way. So um, that's basically our update for the spring. We're going to keep chickens again. We're ready to get started with that. We're ready to get started with the garden. And as for bees, we're ready if they decide to come around or if somebody calls us to catch a swarm. So we're just kind of go, going to go with that. Um, my work schedule has really changed a lot. So as far as putting videos out, I'm gonna still try to do that. My goal was one a week. I don't know if I'm still gonna be able to manage that. I haven't been able to the last couple months, but I'd like to at least put one or two out a month and hopefully a little more than that. Let me know what you guys are up to too. Uh, what do you have going on for the spring? What are you doing to get ready for the growing season? Do you have any interesting tips or suggestions for luring bees in or anything like that? I'd love to hear about it. Don't forget to hit the thumbs up button and subscribe and share with your friends and have a happy spring and good luck to all of you in the growing season ahead. I'll catch you guys later. Bye.